And we begin with that breaking news tonight, holiday heartbreak. A county park on Milwaukee's north side is now a crime scene. This after sheriff's office says a two-year-old was hit and killed by a car. Sam Kramer is live outside McGovern Park tonight. Sam, what have we learned since we last checked in at 9 o'clock? Hi there, Ted and Mary. Well, this park was full of families celebrating, full of cookouts. Uh, earlier today, again, honoring Father's Day. Tonight, a tow truck just arrived on scene, presumably to take away the vehicle involved in that crash. Again, a day meant for celebrating families ends in heartbreak for one family. I was playing basketball over there with a couple of people. It's right around 6.30 Sunday night. We all heard a, a loud scream. Travion Crockett says that scream and a subsequent fight were enough to stop the game just north of a parking lot on the west side of McGovern Park. I thought what was going on, what was happening, until I ran over here and seen blood on the ground, and I seen a car stand right there, and I seen people get emotional and all that. And not long after that, Crockett says police and paramedics we're quickly on scene. I see the kid get hit by a dead, see the ambulance people get the child up and see if it's okay. Enrolled with a med unit to children's for a child that was struck. They advise that it may become a heated situation. But the Milwaukee County Sheriff's Office says the victim, a two year old child, died after they were hit by a vehicle. The news turning Sunday somber on a day meant for celebrations. People do speed and all that crap, and, but you gotta watch out for the kids, man. Yeah. I don't know, she might have called a kid, I did not, but you still gotta watch out for the kid. That's the whole kid. So tonight, about three and a half hours later, there's still a lot we do not know. We have asked the sheriff's office whether uh, detectives believe that this was accidental or intentional and whether that driver is cooperating with their investigation. We have not heard back just yet, but when we do get those answers, we'll provide them to you both on air and online at fox6now.com. For now, we are live in Milwaukee. Sam Kramer, Fox 6 News.